PAX A80. Introducing PAX. In this video, we will show you how to set up your PAX A80 terminal and go over some basic functions. Power and connection. First, we need to connect the terminal to power and ethernet. Take the power cord and plug it into the power port underneath the terminal. Take the ethernet cable and plug it into your port labeled LAN. Wi-Fi. If you chose to use Wi-Fi, here's how you set it up. From the main screen, press Settings, enter your admin password, and press OK. Press Wi-Fi and select the network you would like to connect to. Enter the Wi-Fi password and press Connect. The Wi-Fi icon will light up in the top right corner of the screen to indicate that the connection was successful. Paper Roll To install a paper roll, Pull the lever at the top of the terminal. Place the paper roll over while facing the front of the terminal and close the lid. Transaction, sale. Next, let's run a transaction. From the main screen, press sale, enter the amount and press the green OK button. Have your customer insert or tap the card. The approved message and a copy of the receipt will display on the screen. Tap Print and the terminal will offer to print a customer receipt. You can always reprint the receipt by tapping Reprint from the main screen. Transaction Void Now, if you need to void a transaction that is sitting in the open batch, tap Void on the main screen. The terminal will prompt you to enter a transaction number. You can locate it on the receipt under Record Number. Enter the number in question and tap or press the green OK button. Tap Enter and the terminal will prompt for a signature. Sign the screen and tap Approve. Press Print to print the void receipt. Settlement To settle an open batch, tap Func for functions on the main screen. Tap Settlement and then tap Clear. The terminal will display batch success message and the batch report will print automatically. Refund To refund a transaction from the settled batch, tap Refund from the main screen. Enter the amount and press or tap the green OK button. Have the customer insert or tap the card. The terminal will display Approved and offer you to print the receipt. Moto Transaction To process a Moto Transaction for the card not present orders, tap Moto on the main screen. Enter your admin password and press the green OK button. Enter the amount and press OK. The terminal will prompt you to enter a card number. Enter the card number and press OK. Merchant Settings to access the Merchant Settings menu, tap Settings on the main screen. Enter your admin password and press OK. Here you can adjust multiple settings such as Operator ID Prompt, Cashback Prompt, Order Number Prompt, and others. Operation Settings In the Operation Settings, you can adjust the font on your receipts, change receipt print settings, and more. Transaction Settings In the Transaction Settings menu, you can enable tips, enable or disable reference prompt for refunds, and more. 